Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to add Google Calendars to uh, Thunderbird Mail Client. So after you install and configure Thunderbird, meaning, Thunderbird, meaning that you add your uh, email and uh, you're able to read and download uh, your email, uh, one of the things that I like to do is to add my Google Calendars into uh, Thunderbird. And for that we need uh, an extension called Lightning. So if you click on the settings icon and uh, go to options, add-ons, I'm sorry, and click on add-ons and then click on extension. Uh, in my situation, in my configuration, Lightning is already uh, installed, but if it's not there, just go into the search box and type uh, Lightning and press enter. Uh, it should be the first one on the list, so click on that one and click Add to Thunderbird. After that, you might have to uh, restart Thunderbird um, as a final step. Uh, so once uh, Lightning has been installed, the next step uh, is to go into your um, Google Calendar. So open your browser and log into your Google uh, username profile in open calendar. Once you have calendar open on your left uh, on your left side uh, you should have your username displayed uh, under my calendars. So uh, next to your username uh, click on this the three the dots icon and then click on settings and sharing and then scroll all the way down to what it says secret uh, address in iCall format and uh, copy this and go back into uh, Thunderbird and now click on this uh, icon to open your calendar and here I want to right click on the calendars and select new calendar I am going to select on the network because my calendar is on the network and click next. Uh, I want to leave it as icon and for location I'm going to control V to paste my calendar and I'm going to click next. I'm going to name it uh, I'm going to say George calendar and click next and finally I'm going to click finish um, so in order to test uh, whether I have my calendar properly configured I am going to go into my calendar Google uh, Calendar And I'm going to create a dummy event. I'm going to click uh, any day and I'm going to say this is a test event. I'm going to click save, go back into Thunderbird, and um, let's do right click and synchronize calendar. And now I have my this is a test event. Additionally, you might want to do the same thing here. You might want to click a new event and uh, save it and then go back into Google Calendar and uh, now the event should be uh, listed here. Meaning that you have properly configured uh, uh, Google Calendars uh, using Lightning in Thunderbird. And that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed the video and as always remember to subscribe uh, and thanks for watching.